In this video, we are going to be making festive llamas using instant coffee. Now, I got inspiration for this image from Jessica at Kelly & Co. She has an Etsy shop and she lives in New Zealand. All right, so the first thing you need to do is get some of your instant coffee working into pigment. So you're going to take some of the little, little grounds and just mix it until it's an even, smooth texture. Now, you'll want different shades of this, so you might just take a little bit of what you've already mixed and then take some more water, and then that will lead you, leave you with a lighter shade. And you can do that one more time and just even have an even lighter shade of coffee grounds. So having this sort of tonal value will help you while you're making these llamas. Alright, so in making the llamas, you want to leave the face white. So you're going to do a big oval where the face will be. And then you're going to kind of come up a little bit and back down towards the oval and then curve around or the bottom. Really, we're just making kind of the front um, view of the llama, this little neck. And then we'll just have little ears coming down. So you want to try to make those as triangular as possible. And there we go, one llama. A bunch more llamas to go. So we're going to do that circle, by circle I mean oval, and then come up a little bit and then back down. Something you have to be careful of is actually waiting for your llama to dry before you do a llama that overlaps with it so that you don't get too much bleeding. So right here I kind of forgot and I just left a little bit of room so that it wouldn't bleed in and then maybe I'd add a little bit of pigment after. If you're running into a little problem with the bleeding, then you want to have a little bit of paper towel nearby and just fold it so you can get the little spot to just take out the pigment that you don't want. All right, so I like the number of llamas I have. Now, the last little things to do with the coffee grounds are to add in the little ears. And the other things you're gonna do once everything is dried. So, I'll show you the, a couple of the little ears and then come back once they're dry and ready for everything else. Well, the front llamas are dry, so now we can start adding those cute little faces. So you're gonna do an eye with just a little bit of a shine to the side. You're gonna go right over to the very side, other side of the white part and do the same. And then it's just a little up and down, upside down part of partial arrow, and then down in a little curve. So just keep doing those on all your llamas. All right, so now we're gonna make them festive llamas. So be, be sure to kind of pick evenly spaced out lighter llamas for the string for the lights, and then you can start making a cute light pattern. Now all that's left is to add the white highlights. So the artist put little dots of white and also a swirl on the top of the head, kind of like it's llama hair. I hope you enjoy experimenting with using instant coffee as paint, as well as just making these cute little llamas. So have a wonderful day.